hello there welcome to Igo pop uh, in this lecture i will demonstrate idea earlier python so uh, these are the basic command uh, python so they are same in python 2.7 python 3 okay so welcome to IQ pop so what i have done here i have declared a string no, yes in a string uh, and let's see what happens okay so it is declared so in python whenever we need to print something or uh, declare some string we should keep that one in double quote now if you want to add two integer say 45 plus 89 you got the result so 98 minus 43 yeah. and the arithmetic okay now if you want to declare some variable here say a yeah, on variable integer equal to say 87 so you can see that a is declared so if you want to see the value of a okay see it is printing 87 so here we don't need to define any data type for a automatically python will decide what data type should be suitable for a now i'll take another variable b equal to say 42 okay now do some arithmetic on a and b say do c equal to a plus b c now there is another way to do see the result only underscore see so underscore is a system defined uh, special uh, variable in python which stores the last result calculated so all the time if you simply type underscore and enter you will find this uh, find the last result what was calculated now do some more arithmetic say a minus b yes a multiplication b a divide b or b divide a okay and you can do b mod a which is a modulus operation or which returns you the remainder so remainder 42 now if you do the reverse thing a mod b then you can see it is 3 uh, what other thing we can do yeah we can do some logical operations also say a less than b if yes it is written true if no it is written false so it is saying false so reverse thing should be true so b less than a yeah it is true let's say I want to make both the values same so a equal to b so now uh, a is going to assign the value of b right now if I ask does a equal to equal to b if both of us, uh, them are having same value it will return true yeah it is returning true yeah um, what other thing we can do here uh, we, yeah, we can concatenate to string like welcome plus another string say iq pop uh, there is no space if we want to add one space also we uh, will concatenate a space in between like this plus in quotation in quotation give a space and plus the space will concatenate in between these two string enter yeah it is done now I will show you most interesting thing that is array so we know that array is a special kind of variable which can store multiple values in it right now uh, beautiful thing in python is that 
array can store different kind of values inside it like integer floating point number string character anything it can store in a single array and that is the good thing so how we can do it array equal to say one comma sorry two one comma sorry two comma five now if i want to see what is there in array simply type array two comma five now if i do array two comma five uh, this two are integer take some floating point number also say ten comma five eight take some uh, string say welcome etc okay enter yeah. uh, doing print array so what it will print it will print the whole thing if you type only array it will print the same if I pre um, print in bracket array uh, it is printing the same thing now as I was saying that uh, we can assign some string inside um, inside uh, some variable so uh, taking some variable s equal to thank you for watching I go pop so t equal to like comment and share and so w equal to I am going to make a video lecture lecturer series on data science yeah tr that is true i'm i'm going to make it a, another video series on data science using python and that will be launched shortly so if you are interested to get update on that one you please subscribe my channel and hang on with it okay so now we see what happened if i do s plus t plus w see now all three sentences or three strings came together 